amazing folks to meet. The people that you greet when you're walking down the street. They do important jobs that they make our town complete. You and me, she and he, we, together with the keys to community. Beep, beep, pardon me, coming through. This place is super cool. Where are we? We're in City Island, the biggest and best place in the world. Nice! We live in a wonderful world, ready for you to explore. Take a look. <gasps> Next up, Circus Beach. This is the art museum. Wow, the library. I can't wait to see it all. <laughs> Watch City Island, streaming now on PBS Kids. Let's Go Luna is made possible in part by contributions to your PBS station from viewers like you. Thank you. get moving fast and slow. Let's start with stretching your arms out and flapping them like this. Like a bird. That's it. And bend your knees too. You're flying. Now I want you to flap your wings faster. Um, maybe not that fast though. You got it. Flap faster so you can fly higher. Now let's slow it down with a simple marching move like this. One, two, one, two, one, two. That's it. Now march faster. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Whew, that was fun. You were great, guys. Thanks. See you next time, everyone. My name is Michelle Garman, and I am a first grade teacher at San Diego Vista Elementary School in Rio Rancho, New Mexico. PBS Kids has helped me as a teacher of young children in countless ways. I use Nature Cat in my classroom. It's a great resource for learning about the natural world. There's an amazing episode, and it talks about butterflies and how things grow. So the kids got to do research and watch the caterpillars grow and change and they were able to watch Nature Cat clips about that. Tally-ho! His tally-ho became like a rally cry at recess. My kids would run outside and they're like, tally-ho, Miss Garmin, let's look for the animal habitats under the slide. PBS Kids helps my students learn more about the world around them. How do your favorite PBS Kids Pals explore the outdoors? They head to the beach. It's a tiger stripe seashell. Discover flowers. Oh, they smell really pretty. And give the dog a bath, or at least attempt to. There are lots of ways to head out and explore. Find out your favorite. OK, you're on. For adventures with all your friends all in one place, stream now free on PBS Kids. Everyone, it's me, Dot, and it's time to get moving with PBS Kids. We're going on an animal adventure today. First, let's hop up and down like this. Hop, hop, hop. Can you guess what animal does this? A frog! Hopping from one lily pad to the next. Good. Now stretch your arms out like this and flop them up and down. That's right, guys. You're flying. What animal flaps their wings? A bird. Bend your knees, too. And finally, let's gallop with our feet like this. Can you guess what animal does this? You've got it, a horse. Giddy up. Whew, that was fun. You guys were great. Thanks. See you next time, everyone. 
PBS Kids asks, what do you like to do? Hey, everybody. I'm Elin, and I like to touch my tongue to my nose. See? <laughs> what do you think? What do you like to do? The Cat in the Hat knows a lot about that. Is made possible in part by a cooperative agreement with the U.S. Department of Education, the Corporation for Public Broadcasting's Ready to Learn grant, and by viewers like you. Thank you.